Good morning, teacher Myla. Good morning, classmates. I am Ethan Cal Ramos, and today I'm going to tell you a story about the showdown by Livy Brereton and illustrated by John Bennett. Jake lived on sheep farm. All of the sheep on the farm had nice thick wool. Some sheep had white wool, some sheep had black wool. All the sheep had their wool cut by the sheep shearer, but Jake did not go. He was afraid. Jake hid from the sheep shearer. Why didn't you get your wool cut? The other sheep asked. I was too busy eating grass, Jake said, and I was too busy watching you. Poor Jake's wool grew very long. It dragged in the mud. It got in his eyes so he couldn't see. Jake's wool was just too long. In fact, Jake was a mess. And this summer was hotter than any other. Jake tried to stay in the shade. He splashed in water to cool down, but he was still too hot. Jake watched the other sheep with their short wool. They didn't look hot at all. They looked cool and happy. What am I going to do? Poor Jake said. He was hot and messy. He was tired of having a long wool coat. I will get my wool cut, Jake said. But Jake hid when the shearer came again. He stood behind the barn and shook. Then Jake saw a large crowd of sheep. He saw TV cameras and big lights. What is going on? said Jake. The sheep in the crowd were taking pictures and pointing. Who were they pointing to? They were pointing to Legs. Legs was a famous sheep shearer. I'm so happy to be here, said Legs. The crowd cheered. Jake cheered with them. I am here for a new TV show. It is called the Shorn Sheep Showdown. Today I will make one of you look like a star, said Legs. Legs was looking around the crowd at all the sheep. He saw Jake with his long and messy wool. Legs walked past the other sheep. He stopped at Jake. You must be very hot on your all that wool. Would you like to have your wool cut? Asked Legs. Jake began to shake. He was afraid. All the other sheep were looking at him. But then Legs smiled at him and patted his back. Jake took a deep breath. Yes, please cut my wool, he said. In one hour, Jake will look like a star, said Legs. Legs led Jake to a special chair. Legs put up a screen to hide Jake. Jake could hear the crowd cheering. Legs washed Jake's wool. Then Legs began to cut. Legs was so nice that Jake didn't feel afraid. Jake saw his long wool fall to the ground. One hour later, Legs was done. Are you ready to see your new look? Legs said. Legs pulled back the screen. Jake looked in the mirror. Jake's wool was short in most places, but around his ears, his wool was curly and long. Jake looked great! The crowd cheered. Jake had faced the shorn sheep showdown. I will never be afraid to cut my wool again, said Jake. Thank you so much for watching and like this video for more videos. Bye!